Here we've got a couple of seats that have been neglected for a long, long time. And I don't even know if you can get this stuff out of here or if these seats just have to be thrown away. But what I wanna do is take three different products and I want to try and clean these. I don't know if it will clean up, but we're going to try and we will see how it goes as time goes on. So the first thing I wanna do is I wanna try our goof off rust remover. So this stuff right here works great on all kinds of rust and stuff like that but it says it's a stain remover so maybe it'll do something with this but that stent that mold or whatever it is it really like eats its way into the plastic and it's i don't know if you can really get it out once it's in the pores of the plastic so that's what we're going to try first let's try the goof off and then we'll try something else Well, the goof off never disappoints. It did a phenomenal job compared to this and that. I mean, it get, got a lot of the service stuff off, but the stuff is just so deep down into the pores that it doesn't seem like that's gonna cut it. Um, maybe over time, it would lift it up. So now, what we're gonna try is just some straight bleach. I'm actually pretty surprised at just the bleach too. The bleach did pretty good. Just straight bleach on there. Obviously you can tell how bad the plastic or whatever this stuff is, it's all coming off. But you can still see a lot of spots that aren't coming off with the bleach. Now, in all honesty, if you just soak these things in bleach or the rust off, you would probably I, you might even just need the bleach just pour bleach on this thing and if you could live with that this way better than that but let's try one more thing to kind of see if we can't get this deep deep stain out of there because this is all surface stuff it looks like because the bleach actually ate that stuff out a lot of this looks like it's just surface so let me try another thing being our barkeeper's friend this stuff works great for stains people use it to clean all kinds of stuff stove tops and sinks and stuff so let's see what this does on here Okay, we've got the barkeeper's friend mixed up with the bleach. We're just gonna let that sit for a few minutes. I've just been using this cheap little $3 kitchen brush, whatever, to kind of scrub down in, get the stuff worked down into the pores. But let's give that a minute to kind of sit there and see if the plastic will soak that up. And then we'll scrub it a little bit more and then rinse it off to see what we're left with obviously we're not going to get these things back to this bright white beautiful chairs but if you can make them clean to where 
they look all right to sit on it doesn't look like you're going to get sick from sitting on it as long as it doesn't look like that then you can have people on your boat so this is what we're left with after the barkeeper's friend it's not a whole lot better than it was with just the bleach and the goof off um I do need to try vinegar. Vinegar is the only thing I haven't tried. And from what I understand, you might be able to take vinegar, let vinegar sit on this for like an hour or two hours or something like that, and then wipe it off. Okay, here is our vinegar, just some cheap vinegar. Um, a lot of people say you should just, you know, mix this up like, you know, half water or half vinegar, but I'm just gonna dump this straight on the seat and we're gonna see what happens. After we've done Barkeeper's Friend, we've done Goof Off, we've done Bleach, and we've done Vinegar, there are still some pretty heavy stains on the seat that you can see and you really can't get away from. In my opinion, I don't think you can get these off. I think that's going to be what the best it's going to look like. You're still going to have stains on the seat, but if you took this chair off flipped it over and let that bleach and goof off and everything sit on the stains some of them might come out and get to like this point but you'll still have a stain that looks like this in some areas where you just can't get that out that is just inside the plastic and that plastic unless it comes out i think this looks so clean right here because you can tell where the plastic's actually gone so I don't know if you could sand these down but that might be an option other than that this is about as good as you're gonna get it to look so that's what it is these are what we use to clean it vinegar barkeeper's friend goof off rust aid and just um, straight up bleach and I would say these two are th are the best the goof off and the and the the bleach but in all honesty you can find these chairs on amazon for anywhere from a hundred to two hundred dollars so with cushions on the top and the bottom they don't come with this metal bracket so as long as your bracket down here is good to go what you can do is take these chairs off and take these brackets off clean your brackets off and just buy new chairs otherwise that's what you're going to be looking at and we just started a brand new podcast channel called the boaters podcast where we're answering comment questions and emails that you guys have sent us asking us questions so go check that out and subscribe to that channel now because the first episode is out right now